How's it going everyone? What's up? We're going to get the video and today I'm playing against Rumble. Now Rumble is annoying and he has been nerfed, but I don't care. I want to play AP Gangplank and I have a Skarner. So you might be saying, well Solar Baka, that sounds absolutely suicidal. Won't you just run it down? That is very much so possible. Do I care? No. You know why? Because I'm going to persevere. Even if I fall behind, it is what it is. So with that being said, let's do it. I got Ultimate Hunter going. I'm going to go Malignance. You guys already know what's up with the AP Gangplank. And with that being said, let's do it. Uh, enemy team could always be ghosting, so, you know. I'm also gonna deafen, just because, like, you know, uh, my teammates aren't gonna provide me anything useful. And I'm also playing against Rumble. Now, I will be hitting these minions, because I assume that Rumble started E. Most Rumbles start E into Gangplank. Which I think is smart. Dodge the Comet, like that. Ooh, we missed that. Did he have... Death I was going to ask if he had Celerity. Reward. I'm not going to crash on the second wave here, even though I definitely should be crashing on the second wave. You might be saying, well, why should you crash on the second wave? Well, it's because Rumble can just press Q on the wave and then just clear it. So then I'm left in pain and misery. Never trust a build I'll go for a deep right. ward. That's a semi-deep ward. Yeah, now my, now my wave's in an awkward spot. Beautiful. We got the crash on Rumble. That's good. Now we can look for a cheeky little reset, perhaps. Well, we have options, right? We have options. The point is to survive, though. Now, in my experience, uh, getting boots against Rumble is very good. So we're going to try and build boots early game. Uh, at least tier 1s, you know? Cheeky little barrel. Nice little cute little barrel there. Nice, look at that. Good trading. Now, does Rumble have two health potions? Yeah, so does he care about that trade? Definitely not. But hey, when you play against Rumble, listen, you take the small victories. So, yeah. We're up some CS right now. I'm thinking about how I want my itemization to be this game. I I definitely want Trinity into Malignance, and then we'll see what we do after that. And you might be saying, well, why is this a good uh, AP game besides you wanting it? Well, the reason why I think it's a good AP game in particular is because I have a lot of CC on my team. I've got Skarner, I've got a Blitzcrank. Oops. My teammates have no will to live, though. Okay, not bad. You know, we didn't get aced, so something is better than nothing. But no, we have Blitzcrank, we've got Skarner, and we've also got Jin. So APGP does really well with e one of two things, either engage or with range, all right? You got the ER. If you've got ER, you've got AP Gangplank because Essence Reaver was killed, so all you're left with is engage and range. That's how you know if you should play some AP Gangplank. In this case, I have both on my team, which I'm really, really liking. Because we've been trapping uh, the lane so much for this rumble, we can't get anything done. So we're going to be able to buy Sheenan boots here. Is mana crystal meta ever over? Bro, I didn't go it for one game. And I explained this in my item guide video, if you cared to even pay attention in the first place. But, you go D-Shield when you're against specifically rumble. Toss him to the shark. I want to slow push away. Can you not do that, please? I'm literally thinking about minions and you're screaming in my disgusting ear, Phantasm Knight. Hey, thank you for the bits, though. Everyone pays. Asshole. Hi. An ally has been slain. Barrel. 
That was pretty stupid. The prior should always be grubs there. They're they're probably asking why didn't Gangplank hard us? Because you play for grubs there. You do your little poke to rumble and then you run away. You don't stick around. I don't come. That was very, very dumb. Trust nothing. Even if I'm there, right? There's no guarantee Rumble dies because we don't have burst. Even though we have the CC, we don't have the burst. Really good combo. What the hell? Oh, I'm AFK. <laughs> My whole team's fighting, and I'm a little AFK. Well, Rumble just got a triple kill, but it's fine. My team played it well. Really, really good uh, roam by Jin. Oh, the misery! Okay, I missed cannon, but if I get this plate, it's basically like I didn't miss cannon. Beautiful. It's like I never missed cannon. Huge. It's literally like I never missed cannon. Beautiful. That's what we like to see. But I... Beast, well played, well played. Thank you, Mr. Skarner. Because we muted our team and we've been focusing, by the way, we don't waste our time on things that are unnecessary. And I recommend that you guys all watching the video do the same. If there's ever times where you're playing Gangplank and you're like, man, my teammates are griefing the shit out of me, just deafen and focus up, alright? Especially if you play on EU West, my god. Especially if you play on the EU West server. Because you have to lock in here. Any mistake happens, Gangplank, Gangplank is Jover. Alright, I got my ult up. Jin just missed his W on the recalling target. Jin just missed his W on the recalling target. Maybe it's fine. There's another wave coming. They should just hard shove that since it's not a cannon. stings like salt on a wound. Sometimes I leave pings open, never chat. That's smart. Uh, a lot of people play like that. I think Santorin's one of them. He uh, has zero chat, but he keeps pings open. Mercy sank with my ship. I think the enemy team wants to touch me. Always watch your back. They're slow pushing a wave. The only reason you ever slow push waves like this is if you're ready to dive. Death spit me out. <laughs> Come on, no movement speed? Run. Yo, that guy's super strong, by the way. Bork. No movement speed, bro? Ugh, whatever. It's fine. We have our Trinity and Rumble died. It's okay. Okay. Rumble Rumble has killed like all of his momentum because of this Skarner ganking me top lane. And he has literally zero momentum. And it looks like Skarner had perfect gold for Heart Seal. So overall that was worth it. Super super worth. Adam thinking the prime 24 months in a row. This jungler's stealing kills. Yeah, he stole uh two kills, right? He stole two kills that he could have given me. But, you know, at the end of the day, I love my jungler. You know what I mean, chat? I love my jungler. It's fine. 
He's gonna be helping the rest of the teammates. My the rest of my teammates out. He helped me against Rumble. I appreciate him. An enemy is <laughs> ah, Is that a flash I just heard? Oh my gosh, thank god Jin landed that. If Jin didn't land that, it was so over. Oh! Skarner mechanics! Holy! The Skarner mechanics, dude. Played, guys. They, I, I, I spam pinged it as much as I could. Don't go for tower. They all went for tower. Killed themselves. They're so stupid. And Rumble just got like more gold too. And he got XP. Like you're so dumb. It's it's so obviously stupid, bro. The amount of times people will lose the game over grubs. It's so nasty. It's like, yo, guess what? If you give up the grubs, the enemy team can't hit tower against Oriana Skarner Blitzcrank, bro. How are they ever hitting tower? But now look, you lost all your jungle camps and your game is unplayable. It's so stupid. Who cares about grubs? They're not that serious. Nice, guys. We got three grubs, but we lost the game. Ooh, close. Maybe I could have ulted that. Positive attitude sure vanish, bro. I am not positive. If you think I'm positive, then they're then uh hey, that's all you bro. I'll tell you what though, you know what does make me positive? Playing against Rumble. Because playing against Rumble, I get so depressed I have no choice but to be positive. I'll hack my way back to Bilgewater. I'm not agree with you about crabs, the grubs. Everybody's game became harder as a result of that. He made top lane harder, he made jungle harder, and he made mid lane harder. Making the game hard is not a good thing. Making the game harder is not good. I don't want to reset just yet. Actually, I should reset. Yeah, no, I should reset, actually. What am I doing here? Relative to league standard, again, that's whatever you put on me. I never market myself to be positive at all. Actually, you know what? I'm a positive streamer. True. I am a positive streamer. True. Damn it. I, I, dude, I want Ultimate Hunter stacks, but I can't get them. But at the same time, Viego wasn't one of them. Yeah, Viego's not one of them. It's fine. It's Aphelios and uh, Milia. No, you're not yet. Right. Everybody who's a long-term Solar Rock viewer know, knows that I am a positive streamer. I would never say anything bad about my teammates, like them having to be boiled alive, them having to be killed, not get anything bad, something in their head. Nah, we don't do that. We don't I diagnose people. Ship, but not my soul. All right, I got my ult up. Let's do it. We're close to our Maligma. Yeah, I would never say young man. <laughs> I would never use the Gordon Ramsay young man emote. Flesh ever. Wait. <laughs> I would never say to GPQ yourself. <laughs> True. Okay, uh, what's going on here? Dragon? <gasps> yes! This is the best soul for AP Gangplank. And... 
do you guys know why Infernal Soul is the best for AP Gangplank? It's because of the Cinders. It has literally nothing to do with anything else. It, it's because of the Cinders. Shut down. Okay, we got kind of dog walk. Shut okay, that guy down. walked onto Rumble. All right, cheers, guys. Uh, we do not feel like winning. We're close to Maligma. That's what I really want. I think you could have flash ulted. You can't cleanse a suppression, so I think it would have been worth it. To kill a Felios there. Maybe not. Maybe it's too risky. Does he know that if he ults, they can't hit him back? Your turret has been destroyed. Will come back stronger. Well, he has a full Sterex. That guy is beefy now. Holy. Our Skarner is beefy now. Damn it, Chuck, thank you the Prime 10 months in a row. Okay, with this big Wombo combo team comp, I think I should go Imperial Mandate. Normally, I would go Leandries, but they're not that HP heavy. They're not that HP heavy, and they have a few dashes. So, Burst. If I'm thinking of Burst, I'm thinking of Mandate. I rarely forget and never yeah. forgive. Mandate is kind of like Bork, uh, for, but for support items. That's how I view it. Also, you have Orianna mid. What you talking about? But yeah, it'll proc. More powder. Hate is a child's word. Everyone All right, Dragon's up in two minutes. You know, I haven't seen any Cinders. Where are the Cinders? We can't be messing that up, bros. That blitz crank hook. It's okay though. Good job. Trailblazer is actually doing work. Did you guys see that? We're all running away? <laughs> Dude, Jin has 460 movement speed because of his Trailblazer. It's kind of OP. So, you guys gonna do Krugs? No, in that case, I'll do Krugs. I'll take Krugs. Or will Skarner take them? Maybe Skarner will take them. My vengeance will be blind. Why are you going for AP? Because I have to perma side lane. So because I'm perma side laning, I'm never going to have a good TP into a fight. So think about it this way, right? I could have 1000 AD, but I'll never be part of the fight. So because he, even though I have 1000 AD, if I'm not part of the fight, I'm doing zero damage. Because I can't hit anyone if I'm not in the fight. So, I'm going AP Gangplank to get some damage off while I wave clear. Okay, a little bit newbie. Wait, can I full buy? I can. I can just full buy Mandate, I'll do that then. Okay, they're gonna crash that into bot tower. I have my mandate now. We would buy enough AD for Sheen and then get a Lich Maid? Wondering what changed? They removed, uh, it, they removed the minion Dematerializer from the game. Dematerializer got removed from the game. 
that that is the item that I uh, I would go, and I would just go Sheen like Longsword into Lich Bane. How much mana do you? 334. Isn't that kind of crazy? Wait, isn't that kind of crazy? This item cross map just did an additional 400 damage, 389. That's pretty good. You, you have to remember that my ult is damage over time. Oh. Oh my lord, we just got cooked. Look like a patient man. Wait, what the fuck is that item, man? It's good! I did 400 damage off of pressing ult, and it's done more than Malignant's. Not only that, but it's good because Leandris does less damage, and it's also more expensive. Leandris does less damage in this specific game. It's cooked. Bring them from the slaughter docks. If I really wanted to be support gangplank, I could also buy a redemption. That's better. They're, I think they're gonna start Baron. Yeah, if they start Baron though, I'm here. Paint the docks. He'll ward it. Okay, well, nobody walked up, so there's no point in ulting it. it. Literally, if nobody's gonna walk up to Baron, then there's no point in me ulting it. But I'll ult that to get uh, delayed recalls. They should all be resetting. I have options. I could go Leandries, I could go uh, Horizon Focus. Again, they don't have a lot for... They don't have a lot for my Leandries to work off of, so I think I'm just gonna go Horizon Focus. Like, mid has no HP, AD has no HP, support doesn't, jungle doesn't, and these fights are instant. They're like that. So you want to do as much damage as quickly as possible. These aren't very drawn-out fights. Rare game where I don't go Leandris. Keep a weather eye out. Reckoning approaches. Let's go collect some cinders. Let's get our item and then collect some cinders. What is this horizon focus build path? Yeah. Double fiendish codex. Like what's going on? Okay, I am very strong. My ult nukes. We're two levels up on literally every single person in the game because we've just been permanently side laning. I'll take back what's mine. Look at the AP GP, look at the AP Gangplank, look at the AP Gangplank, do you see how they can't play? Do you see that? AP Gangplank, I just solo zone them off. Oh. oh, I'm a noob! Stick to pressing R, you idiot. Oh my god, stick to pressing R. You can't land any barrels. You're so bad. Alright, next we should get Sword Pen Shoes. So in that fight, Imperial Mandate did another 400 damage. Malignants did a lot more that fight. Oh, guys, look at this. In one Gangplank ult, my Horizon Focus did 800 additional damage. Just think about that. I landed zero barrels that fight. That's all from my ult. If I push one more wave, I can get my item. Or level 16. Which I think is worth it. Also, keep in mind, look at my haste. I was sitting at 50% CDR briefly. Another. 
I TP. <laughs> I missed the center. They all have to run away though. If I didn't if I didn't miss the center there, I think we could have maybe wiped. But I missed the center of my ult. I also think we could have been fighting earlier. What's your last item? I'm thinking of either Shadow Flame. I'm thinking of Shadow Flame, or we do finally build the Andries because even though they don't have as much health, now their base levels are higher, and I imagine they're just gonna hit level 14 as well. This is really bad. Yeah, this is really bad. Abyssal Mask is nerfed? I don't get in melee range to use Abyssal Mask. Please get Abyssal Mask. It is so 1v9. Nice, he sold his, his other Null Magic. Thank you, bro. Uh, Yeah, I think I will go Shadow Flame. Because my entire build is just Burst, right? So I think we'll just keep it going with Shadow Flame. Like, we go Leandries. I think our damage will overall... Like, our DPS will go... No, I... Bro, their, their, their health isn't that high, and I have other people hitting them. I'm not just one person. I have other people hitting them that I think it is worth it to just go uh, Shadow Flame. Hate is a child's Pay attention to the numbers, right? Remember them. 1422, 1034, 1177. Remember those numbers. Keep a weather eye out. I'm 100 CS up over Rumble now. This is huge. Hextech Alternator is always a nice component to buy. I have all three ult upgrades at 28 minutes against Rumble, and only one death as well. Really good Rumble ult. What the fuck? We just fucking blasted them. Yep. Beautiful gameplay goal. I didn't orange in time. That guy's so weird for doing that, by the way. That that's so that's such a bad play from him. Then again, he knew I was even worse to not orange, so who am I to be upset? I'm even worse though. He made a bad play like that and I didn't orange, I'm even worse than him. So my bad. How come people don't get annoyed by you going AP ever? They do. They do get annoyed. I've had games where I will drop like 100,000 damage, 30 kills, whatever it is. And then if we lose the game, they'll be like, bro, why did you AP? You're trolling. And then they have 25 deaths. Zero kills, 25 deaths, no KP. And they'll be like, bro, why'd you go AP? How much speed to R to allies? It's 20%. It's either 20 or 30% movement speed. It doesn't show you it. Check numbers. So this went up a little bit. This went up a little bit. This went up a little bit. I really have to land the center, bro. If I hit the center, it's cooked for the enemy team. We can fight Dragon here. See, the nice thing about AP Gangplank is it allows you to do Dragon while also getting the enemy team off Baron. Like, it's not always like you have to pick one or the other. You know what's good too? Serpent's Fang. I could have actually built Serpent's Fang here instead of Alternator. You know, you've got a Starax here, you've got a Shield Bow here, you got Melio, you got Barrier. It, it's not bad, actually. Trust nothing to check.
I have oranges up soon. One, can we Nash? Nice, we killed the uh, Melio, so now we can Nash. Death spit me out. We don't have a whole lot of da we don't have a whole lot of damage to start the Nash though. My ult's on a 50 second cooldown though, which is really nice. Why is my Jin one HP? I don't understand why Jin recalled. Jin recalled. If Jin did not recall, we could have cooked. Uh, Jin, re Jin, see, Jin did two things wrong. He chased Viego for no reason, and then he also reset randomly. So weird. I feel like I should use split pushing to my advantage because I have TP and Rumble has ignite and Katarina has ignite. I feel like I should be splitting more. Their bodies will choke the abyss. We have anybody who wants to get vision on Marin? Okay, nice. Playing macro now. If I can have it. Your team has destroyed an inhibitor. No more uh no more fucking around. Play macro. I've got 3k gold now. Huge ult, yeah, it was a good ult. Million ended up flashing too. Okay, let's do this, and then I could wait to like buy Crypto Bloom. I'll buy Elixir of Sorcery. Do you guys see this? How there's two open inhibs right now? We could just do it. I'll take back what's mine. Start it. We fight. Look at this. They have supers going to their base right now. We should fight it. Of damage. They're one HP. We can do Nash. I have oranges on a seven second cooldown, bro.
I could go void stop. Maybe I just go void. Alright, we're full build. We're full build AP gangplank. How did we lose that? I mean, Oriana trolled. I actually know, but that's how we did lose. That's how we did lose. We don't lose the fight, and I think they lose a Nexus turret. Ugh. I mean, they lost the Nexus turret. You know what I should have done? I should have kept pushing top lane. That way they were forced to reset. If I kept pushing top lane so they were forced to reset, it could have been good. If Oriana wasn't... If Oriana didn't die, then it's also free. I could have ulted better too. See, when Jin opens up though, I want to be able for all of us to collapse. That's why I ulted like early. In hindsight, I probably should have just ulted on top of Jin because that's who they want to kill. And if they can't get on Jin, then they can't win. If there's an item I sell in this build, I, lost I don't think I sell anything. I think this is it. I don't want Fang. The only thing I would maybe buy is Leandri's, but Leandri's this late? I'd have to sell Trinity for it. Maybe I could sell my Trinity for Lich Bane, though. For real, for real. Trust nothing to chance. How much does this sell for? 23 and 33? Lich Bane's 32. So I need one more wave, then. That's the way. Comfortable in my absence. I have my ult. All right, we are now full AP gangplank. <laughs> now it's done. We are full AP gangplank. The seas and men be true. I want to group with my team because it's easy for them to catch us out. And nibs are up. Skarner is strong. He's got a Bissell mask. Baron and Elder are what we're waiting for. I mean, I don't know what the fuck we're doing there. It's that like that's just such a bad fight. Can we win it? Nah, I think it's cooked. They have a wave too. I think it was too much. I think Skarner went too deep. And then Jin got rumble ulted. No, they can't survive. Did you? Bro, it was so close. I killed the Katarina off of her Zonias, but I think the fight that we took was just bad. I think it was just a bad fight overall. Let's see. Or, I mean, this is unacceptable. I mean, okay. Oriana is like a hard counter to Katarina, and we're doing 20k. Not just that. Not just as a hard counter, but you have a front line. You have a Blitzcrank and a Skarner. And you're doing 20,000 damage. 
as Oriana. Blitz did half her damage, bro. Just about. Katarina sucked too? Yeah, but Katarina was actually zoning people. And she was chunking Skarner somehow. I have no idea how, by the way, but Katarina was actually doing damage to Skarner. Oriana dying before Infernal Soul was bad too. You legit lost the last fight 4v4, dog, said the Oriana to the Skarner. Well, regardless, 